What's going on YouTube? I am popping out videos like no other. You guys are probably getting annoyed, but fuck it. I mean, you could always skip it. Or unsubscribe, that's fine. It's cool with me, but I feel like I need to start this new series. Alright? You know, I think it'd only be fair. Alright? Now, I have a series that's called Shoes I Would Never Wear. You know? And I piss off a lot of, a lot of sneakerheads, which... Whatever. And then... You know, I figured, you know what? There's a lot of stuff on my mind, dude, that I just want to get out. So I figured I'd start a new series for the gamers. And it's called Most Overrated Games Ever. Yes. These are games that, for some weird-ass reason, are so popular and people just love, but that are just fucking shitty. Now, each episode's just going to be one game. Um... And I'm going to get a lot of hate for this game. I mean, I'm going to get tons of hate. I don't even think I'm even going to get anybody that agrees with me. But, fuck it. You know, I mean, it's the way I feel, dude. It's the way I feel. Um, so, yeah, I mean, honestly, we all know I'm a big gamer. I love games, dude. Of all games, you know. I'm not a big RPG fan, but I still love them. You know, I love RPGs. I love all, all games. Old games, new games. Gay games, shitty games, I love them all. Cheesy games, whatever. So you can't, you can't tell me I'm not a gamer. I have over a thousand video games, dude. A thousand video games, like I'm not joking. Over 30 systems, dude. I'm, I just love games. But this game, dude, it's an N64 game. <laughs> you guys probably already know what this is. You, you guys probably already know. You guys are like, oh, I know what he's gonna say. And if you do know, if you already know what I'm gonna say, then you, then you agree with me that this game fucking sucks if you already know. Um, and I have some stories to tell about this game, and I'm gonna give you my reasons as to why this game fucking sucks. That is, GoldenEye 007. Yes, it is true. This game reeks of ass, dude. This game sucks. Okay. Now you're like, System Psycho, you got to be out of your mind. This has got to be one of the best-selling games, if not the best-sold the, the best sold game on the Nintendo 64. They even made a sequel, or they made tons of sequels, or they redid it on the Wii. You can't say this game sucks. I can say this game sucks all day, and I will, because I can. So, why does this game suck? Let me give to you my reasons to why this game is so shitty. Now, I played this game. I literally played this game back in the day when it first, like, released. And even then, dude, I didn't see the big thing about this game. First of all, the colors suck. I swear there's only, like, four colors in this game. Black, white, gray, I guess you say brownish peach? That's it. The graphics suck. They're terrible. They're all blocky and choppy. The controllers suck. You know, it's a pretty primitive first-person shooter. And, I mean... This game is just boring, dude. This game sucks. And I even knew this from the first time I played it. I knew this. I'm not gonna lie. One of the reasons why I don't like this game, first of all, is because it's 007. Like, I, I, don't, I don't care for, for James Bond. I really don't. But that's not the reason why this game sucks. This game sucks because it just sucks. You know, you guys are thinking, well, you just want to be a rebel and say that a popular game sucks when it really isn't, when you know it's not. You really think I'm trying to be an anti-conformist, dude? You really think I'm just doing this to look cool? No. I'm doing this because this game sucks. Alright? Like I said, the game sucks. It's boring. The color sucks. Graphics suck. Gameplay sucks. And then people always tell me, well, you gotta, you gotta see, you, you gotta take it for what it's worth, you know what I'm saying? It's, uh, it's one of the first person shooters, you know what I mean? No, it wasn't. It wasn't the first person shooter. I remember playing Duke Nukem. I remember playing Quake, Unreal Tournament, before this even came out. And those games were way better than this. You're gonna tell me those games suck compared to this? No. No, no, no. Torok is actually a really good first-person shooter. This does not beat out Torok. I'm sorry, Torok is just way better, dude. This game blows ass. And you're, you're asking yourself, why do you even have a copy of this game? You wanna know why? Because when I started collecting, 
I bought this game because I was like, oh, snap, Goldeneye. I remember playing it, but I, you know, I don't remember it being too good, but I'll give it a chance, so I got it for a dollar. I took it home, put that shit in, and I was like, alright, I'm done with this. I'm done with this game. This game fucking sucks. And so, I pretty much keep it, just in case my friends come over and for some rare-ass reason, they want to play this game. This game sucks. Now, let me tell you the stories of this. Hope I'm not taking too much of your time. I mean, you guys are probably already heated. You guys already hit the dislike button. I already know, but it's fine. First story. Um, while I was at school, I have a friend, and he's married. And he was like, him and his wife decided to invite me over for dinner. And he, he, the husband also invited two other friends, the guys. So, you know, you're like, hey man, just come over, we'll eat dinner, we'll play some old school games. I got an N64. You know, I'm like, I was all for it, you know, I right, N64, whatever, you know. I'm not a big fan of the system anyway. But, you know, I, I don't want to be rude. We'll play, whatever, we're cool. So we get there. We eat dinner. And then the four of us, the four guys, like, hey, let's play some N64. So I was like, all right, let's do this. What games you got? He was like, I got, you know, Mario. I got Smash Brothers, which is good. I love Smash Brothers. And he's like, and then I got Goldeneye. And everybody was like, ooh, Goldeneye. Let's play some Goldeneye. And me... I don't like contention, dude. You know, I might I might be a hard ass on my on my videos, but in real life, I'm I'm a really calm guy and I stay away from arguing and all that. So I didn't say anything, you know. I was like in my head I was like, "Ah, damn it." So we started playing. Let me tell you, within the first 2 minutes, I can tell everybody did not want to play this game. The game was boring. We couldn't find anybody. The controllers were bad. Nobody was having fun. Everybody was quiet. You know, you can dude the environment just died down. Nobody, no, and nobody wanted to say anything either. Nobody wanted to be the dickhead to be like, hey, let's play, let's get, let's stop, stop playing this game. But finally somebody did. Somebody was like, hey man, I don't feel like playing. And as soon as he said that, another guy interrupted. He's like, yeah, dude, let's not play this anymore. This game, not good. It's not good, dude. So we ended up playing Smash Brothers, which was totally different. We had an awesome time playing Smash Brothers. Environment was good. We had fun. This, this got thrown back in the basket. This was garbage. And, alright, second story. I was talking to my friend about how bad this game is. And he was like, nah, man, this game's good. This game's good. You know, it was good for back in the day. It's good now. I was like, no, dude. If a, if a game is classic and it's good, then it should be good no matter what. No matter how old it is. This game did not age well at all. You know what I'm saying? And you guys are saying, well, it's an N64 game. Well, okay. Yo, I can pop in Mike Tyson's Punch-Out for the NES and have the funnest time in the world. You telling me you can't play Mike Tyson's Punch-Out today? You're out of your damn mind. You know what I'm saying? I can play Super Mario Bros. 3 and have the funnest time ever. Yeah, it's 8-bit. So what? It's one of the funnest games in the world. If not the best Super Mario Bros. game. Alright? So those games stand the test of time, and you can play them whenever, anytime, any year, dude, any decade. 20 years. This game is what, 15 years old, and this game, the game died. This game sucks. It's not even that old, and it's just garbage. You can't play this today, dude. You cannot play this game today. Second story I wanted to say was, you know, I was talking to my friend about it, and another friend was with us. And I was telling my friend, yeah, man, this game sucks, this game sucks, blah, 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 you know, and he was like, nah, man, this game sucks. And my other friend that was over here in our conversation, he was a big GoldenEye fan. He loved GoldenEye. And he overheard, and he was like, dude, Miguel, well, which is my name, you know, I'm Miguel. He's like, dude, Miguel, you're so right, dude. He's like, I just downloaded it um, on the on the Wii console, or I don't know, he downloaded it somewhere. And dude, I haven't played it in so long, but when I started playing it with Mike, we just looked at each other like, what the fuck? This game sucks, dude. And I was like, Thank you for confirming that, brother. Thank you. And this is a guy that loved this game. I'm talking about, he played this religiously. And he hadn't played it in years. And he figured he downloaded it. He's like, oh, Goldeneye, Goldeneye. Oh, yeah, I gotta download it. He downloaded it, and what happened? He came and told me this game was bullshit. Exactly. Exactly. So, for all of you N64 fanboys, I'm sorry, but this game sucks. It is one of the most overrated games I have ever seen in my life, dude. You know what I'm saying? It just... Okay, I'm not gonna go as far as this, the complete trash of everything. It's, I guess it's an okay first-person shooter. But it does not deserve the hype that it got. 
It's like LeBron James. LeBron James does not deserve the hype that he's getting. What has LeBron James proven to us? Nothing. Why does this man make more money than Kobe, dude? Why? Like, Nike gave him a $90 million contract, and he only gave Kobe, like, what, 40? Or I don't even know, dude. Really? Come on, people. Wake up and smell the coffee. Coffee's kind of bad, but I don't like drinking that shit. But anyways, that was pretty long. I'm sorry, guys. Sorry I rambled off, but I just had to express my thoughts on this game. This game is fucking torture. And it was funny. Look, it's dirty as hell, dude. It's so I haven't even taken the time to clean it. You know why? Because it doesn't deserve to be clean. It deserves to be dirty. Oh my gosh. Anyways, guys, that's it. That's the first episode of most overrated games ever. So thanks a lot. Thanks for watching. I'm gonna be jamming out to my Mega Man X Storm Eagle theme song, and I'm good for the night. Peace.